Hey Seth, it's Mike. Just wanted to give you a brief rundown of the distribution lists in Yahoo Mail. I think they're actually called lists. Uh, this is your inbox setup. Click on the second icon here which is contacts. And down here at the bottom you want to look at this section. These are the actual distribution lists. And you can create a new one just by going to new list and typing whatever you want there. And you can create your own like a test 2. And there it is. Test 2 appears and you can see when you click on it there's no one in there. So you have to add the contacts to it. How to do that? Go to all contacts, check the contacts you want in there, assign contacts to the list, select test two, done, and you're done. Pretty cool. Then to use that list, we go back to our mail. We'll compose quite a fancy email. And when we send group emails, we always put ourselves in the two column. And that is to hide everyone else's email address because you don't want to just be giving every single email you have to every single person on that address. So you put all of those emails in the blind copy uh, section. So here we want to send an email and I want to use the distribution list of RC General, which is like everyone at the track. Actually, it's not. It's nothing. Um, but I created it just as a sample. And you can see as I type it in, this comes up, it's a contact, but it's got a double-headed icon here. It's a, a distribution list. So we click on that and it automatically populates all the addresses in that list directly into the blind copy. And we say like, track news, uh, it's awesome, give us more money. And we send it out and everyone gets the email. So simple as that. Um, you can put, an, like if you saw the other distribution list I had created was called test. Um, so if we put test in there, you can see at the bottom there's a distribution list, the double headed, and it's test, I click on that, and it's got the uh, email addresses for that one in here. Uh, so that's basically it. Uh, let me know if you have any questions, but hopefully that gives you sort of a brief rundown of how the distribution lists work, and if you need any other help or whatever, any other questions, uh, let me know. Uh, and just so you know also, Phil did say that the track is going to be open for tomorrow. Uh, so apparently he was there uh, right now and it looked good, good enough to almost run today. So uh, tomorrow should be good, uh, but we'll see. Anyway, talk to you later. Bye.